Can a person that accepts the SDA doctrines, pays tithes, attends services on Saturday, yet has difficult with a cigarette habit, be baptized? Oh, beloved, Jesus gives complete victory. Would you say amen? amen? And if we know that you have not given up such a habit, we would not baptize you. But don't despair. There are people sitting here right now who have given up greater habits than tobacco by the power of Jesus Christ. Amen. Learn to trust him and keep on coming. I know, I don't have any doubt, I know he is able to give you the victory if you want it. Next, please. Pastor, is anybody in heaven now? Yes, there are people up there. Moses is there. And not only that, but uh, Enoch is there. And Elijah is there. And then there's reference to four and twenty elders redeemed from the earth. They are there. Now, if, by the way, uh, we don't have any guarantee of others. There might be. We just don't know. But we do know that Moses was there and Elijah because they came down to meet the Lord on the Mount of Transfiguration. What we want to do is get up there and meet everybody. It says in the Bible, Pastor, that we are goats and lambs and God is our maker. When God comes again, will we turn into goats and no, lambs? No, 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 no. It's uh, sheep and goats, sheep and goats. And God uses these uh, sort of analogous to two kinds of people. You've got the sheep who is submissive. Always the sheep is submissive. But the goat always has to butt. I would obey the Lord, but. I know it's the truth, but. <laughs> you better get changed from a goat to a sheep down here before Jesus comes next week.